Hi friends, this is Gautam. In this video tutorial, I can teach the topic how to configure EHRP unequal cost load balancing. Let's we can see. This is an example topology. So in this topology, I can use six routers R1, R2, R3, R4, R5 and R6. So R1 router can be connected to R2 router, R3 router, R4 router and R5 router. Using separate serial cable, I will connect an R1 to R2, R1 to R3, R1 to R4 and R1 to R5. So each separate serial cable indicates different WAN network. R6 router also connected to R2 router, R3 router, R4 router and R5 router using separate serial cable. So each serial cable indicates different WAN network. So R6 router can be connected to one local area network. So the IP address can be used for R1 to R2 network is 200.200.200.0 slash 30. This is a net ID. And R1 to R3 network, the net ID is 85.120.72.0 slash 30. R1 to R4 network, the net ID is 103.100.200.0 slash 30. R1 to R5 network, the net ID is 201.50.100.0 slash 30. Next, R2 to R6 network, the net ID is 100.100.100.0 slash 30. R3 to R6 network, the net ID is 150.150.150.0 slash 30. Next, R4 to R6, the net ID is 50.50.50.0 slash 30 and R5 to R6 network the net ID is 201.100.100.0 slash 30 and local area network the net ID is 172.16.30.0 slash 24 so all the WAN network we are using subnet mask slash 30 because in serial cable both end we can use IP address so if you are using subnet mask slash 30 means we can get 4 IP address so one is net ID and another one is in broadcast IP so remaining 2 IP address can be assigned to both ends so if you are using slash 30 means we can use the IP address efficiently in WAN network next one bandwidth each serial port we can assign bandwidth and delay so in EHRP metric calculation by default metric calculation we are using bandwidth and delay so here also we can use default metric calculation so serial 1 slash 0 port we can assign the bandwidth is 500 delay is 1000 serial 1 slash 1 the bandwidth is 1000 and delay is 5000 and serial 1 slash 2 the bandwidth is 4000 and delay is 9000 and serial 1 slash 3 the bandwidth is 8000 and delay is 20000 okay so first of all we can go to the r1 router and assign the ip address to each and every port as well as we can assign the bandwidth and delay so we can go to the r1 router so interface serial 1 slash 0 so IP address so the IP address is 200.200.200.0 so here I will assign 200.200.200.1 and subnet mask is 255.255.252 no shut down to enable this interface here the bandwidth is 500 and delay is 1000 so we can assign bandwidth and delay to this port so bandwidth is 500 right yeah so 500 and delay is 1000 exit next we can go to the next serial interface that is serial 1 slash 1 so the net id is 85.120.72.0 so serial 1 slash 1 ip space address 85 dot 120 dot 120 dot 72 dot 1 subnet mask is 255 dot 255 dot 255 dot 252 no shutdown to enable this interface okay so the bandwidth for serial 1 slash 1 is 1000 and delay is 5000 so the bandwidth is 
thousand and delay is five thousand exit next we can go to this serial one slash two so serial one slash two the net id is one or three dot hundred dot two hundred dot zero slash thirty so ip space address one or three dot hundred dot Two hundred dot one. Subnet mask is two fifty five dot two fifty five dot two fifty five dot two fifty two. No shutdown to enable this interface. So the bandwidth for this serial port is serial one slash one is sorry serial one slash two is four thousand and delay is nine thousand. So bandwidth is four thousand and delay is nine thousand. Exit. Next serial port is. Serial one slash three. So IP address is so two not one dot fifty dot hundred dot zero. So two not one dot fifty dot hundred dot one. Subnet mask is two fifty five dot two fifty five dot two fifty five dot two fifty two. No shutdown to enable this interface. So the bandwidth for this serial one slash three port is eight thousand and delay is twenty thousand. So eight thousand and delay is twenty thousand. Okay, exit. So in R one router, we can go to the each and every serial port and assign the IP address and assign the corresponding bandwidth and delay. Now we can go to the R two router and we can assign the IP address and bandwidth. And delay. So first of all, interface serial one slash zero. So IP space address IP address is two hundred dot two hundred dot two hundred dot two. Subnet mask is two fifty five dot two fifty five dot two fifty five dot two fifty two. No shutdown to enable this interface. So the bandwidth for this port is four hundred and delay is two thousand. So bandwidth is four hundred and delay is two thousand. Exit. Next interface serial one slash one. So IP space address. Hundred dot hundred dot hundred dot one. Subnet mask is two fifty five dot two fifty five dot two fifty five dot two fifty two. No shutdown. So the bandwidth for serial one slash one is thousand and delay is two thousand. 